Cucumber is a easily available kitchen item which can be pasted and applied according to the directions on the face. It will gradually reduce the dark circles generally appearing before the eyes. Next we are going to talk about a cucumber paste which can be used as an external application for reducing the dark circles in the uh, face just below the eyes. What we require for this is sliced cucumber 5 pieces, fresh lemon half slice, green gram powder, two spoons, gingerly oil. One spoon, grinding stone, and a vessel to paste it. Cucumber slices can be grinded. How many slices we should take, doctor? You can take five pieces. Sure. And do we have to actually remove the peels, or the it should be with the skin over it? No problem. We can add we with can the skin. Use the no skin. problem. Five pieces can be well grinded. So it's just the juice, no seeds, no skin, nothing. nothing. We're just going to This is going to be my personal favorites, Doctor. Fine. Juice can be extracted by filtering, squeezing it through a piece of cloth. So is it ready to squeeze now? Yes, that is enough. I'm going to take fresh cloth. I can take a fresh cloth and filter it through the There are so many varieties of cucumber, the yellow cucumbers, the light green ones, which are generally preferred ones. A small green variety is better in that compared to the yellow and other big ones. Small green variety is more having medicinal properties that can be used. I see so much of juice already into this water. Yeah, yeah. it is very juicy in nature. Easily you can squeeze it. That's very simple. You hardly require anything to squeeze it. Same way, one piece of lemon also, you can squeeze it into that. Sure. This should be enough. Yeah, yeah, that will be enough. And a half a lemon or one whole lemon? Half lemon will be sufficient. Sure. Fresh lemon juice. Fine. I'll just get those seeds out before we put in something. Definitely. Thank you.
So this is the cucumber juice, juice mixed with the lemon juice. Ready? Yes. Two spoons of green gun powder. You can add to that. Directly into this. Yes. Two full spoons maybe you can add. Sure. I'll take another one because the first one was a half one. Fine. Yes. Mix it well to make it a paste. Sure. Paste is ready. Yes, paste is ready. It can be used as a face pack, especially under the eyes. Mm -hmm. Before applying the paste, I, you can apply the ginger leaf oil over the face. Yes. Then over that, you can apply this paste. So the dark circles can be reduced by just applying ginger leaf oil layer and this paste. Yeah, if it is continuously used texture of the skin will be improving and the color will be gradually coming down. So how many days it should take before the dark circles vanish off? You can use it minimum for two weeks if it is very very dark in color. Sure. Then gradually the complexion will improve. Great, so I start this for myself. This is going to be my personal favorites. The cucumber paste is ready. can just show how it can be applied over the face. You apply a little gingerly oil. Yeah. On. First you apply a little gingerly oil. You can close your eyes. Where we can up can go up till the nose area. Yeah. And here. You can use a little thick layer. Sure. For how long we can keep this paste? Maximum half an hour. And is there a problem if we do it the upper eyelid also? Or it just should be just on the lower eye pack? We can pack it on the upper eyelid as well. It will not be troubling. And uh, how many days you said? About two weeks to get the results? Yes, yes. Ideally, what is a good time when we can apply this paste? Morning is the best time to apply all these things. And what if person, they don't have time, they have to rush to office, can we still do at bedtime? Night time, generally these things are not advocated. So we have to stick to a time. We have to make a time yeah. for ourselves to repair ourselves, morning. yes. And we have to wait till it gets dried completely. Yes. Wash it with plain water. Yeah, you can wash it with plain water half an hour later. Retta Chandanam can be pasted and mixed well with the prescribed liquids. It can be applied over the face to reduce the acne and heat related rashes on the face. Now we will have a simple remedy to address the acne in the face, dark colors, dark patches in the face, heat related rashes on the face and wrinkles in general. It will be made with the red sandal wood. Mm -hmm. We require a red sandal paste, one piece. So red sandal wood. Piece. Sure. And then milk a little. Milk we require. Very little, very little. 
to make it into a paste form. Mm -hmm. Then the grinding stone. Sure. Red sandal can be made into a paste by rubbing it on the stone. We can use water or milk. With a little water. Just pour a little water, few drops. Yeah. So red sandal and white sandal will definitely have some difference or? Definitely. When the both are cooling in nature, red sandal has got an extra cooling effect. And it relieves discoloration of the skin as well. But this is discoloration in overall dark patches on the face, not dark circles under eyes. Not dark circles, dark patches on the oh. developing then and the can be addressed with this red sandal paste. I'll take some more water. Yes. Either due to the heat inside the body or even outside, rashes can be generally appearing on the face. That kind of rashes and acne in the initial stages can be easily relieved with this red sandal paste. A little more water? Yeah. Now the paste can be taken into a bowl It has to be mixed with little milk A few drops yeah, half spoon maybe, so that it becomes a good paste. You can use my finger? Yes, with finger you can mix it. Any special reason that way we have to mix milk with the paste? Milk is also very good in nourishing the skin. Regenerating the skin, milk is a very good ingredient in it. So that will promote the growth of normal tissues once the damaged tissues are removed. And when uh, one must apply this paste? Paste applications will be better always in the morning. Before applying this paste into the face, you must clean the face with either clean water or with a little rose water. And it's done before bath or after bath? You can have it before bath. I'll take some more milk to make a paste. We can apply soap after this or we have to just wash it with plain water. You can use soap and remove the color also because it will be having a thick color soap can be used to remove it that makes a nice paste of sandal that sandal wood so it's ready to use now is this yes, consistency it is a okay paste. yes it can be used over the face so. continuously for one week 
Mm -hmm. So we have this consistency now. At least one week we require, Doctor. Yes, yes, yes. So this is the consistency that we are going to use. Now the Rakta Chandana paste is ready for application. You can see how it can be applied. You can clean the face with rose water. So we have to do application on whole face or we can select the portions of acne affected area. Yeah, wherever there is acne So affected. probably the acne yeah. affected area we can take and... Yes, yes, so. that area is sufficient. And uh, directly apply the paste? Yes, yes, with fingers you can apply it directly sure. over the face. And she can see results in eight days' time? Heat related rashes and acne will be coming down within one week of time. Discolorations may take little more time. There we go. That's done for her. Do we have to apply just on the acne or we can use the other surface also for her? And generally over the cheek. As a whole, you can apply it as a thick pack because acne mostly appears on the entire cheek, you know. So it can be applied over the cheek as a whole. So this surface should be complete for her? Yes, yes. And it shouldn't be applied under the eyes or any area that needs to be avoided? We need to be careful of any particular area? Nothing. Most of the affected areas are coming on the cheeks. So there you can make it as a thick paste. So seven days, and it can be done even more than that? If needed, I think in discoloration at all, you can do it for one more week. And will it be healthier that if we don't have a acne complaint, still we apply it for getting a good complexion, will that benefit or there are some other techniques for it? Just to improve the discoloration and all, I think this is not the better option. This will be cooling your skin on the face and because of that the rashes and the acne is withdrawn back. So I think this is better for acne and rashes, heat later rashes. Most of us, like earlier, it was all the kids where parents would complain they are glued to the television. But now it's not anymore just the television. It's most uh, the kids, the adults, the working class, everybody is glued now to the computer. And uh, with all these variations, the use of eyes has gone to overuse and misuse of eyes. So let's, uh, why not start from that doctor, what we can give to our viewers how to protect the eyes. Definitely, I think we will start with a uh, very small program yes. uh, which will be protecting the eyes and preventing major disorders in eyes. It is very, very natural and easy to prepare also at home levels. This is a home preparation which is very popular throughout India and can be easily made. All that we require to prepare this is a silver lamp, a silver plate, two wooden blocks, cow's ghee, Castor oil, and the cotton wick.
cotton wick may be soaked in cow's ghee. Cut in the lamp. Fill the lamp with cow's ghee. Light the lamp. Wooden blocks can be placed on either side of the lamp. In such a way that it is almost 2 cm above the burning light. Keep the silver tray upside down over the wooden block. So that the soot emanating from the light is completely collected on the inner part of the plate. I have a question here, sir, doctor. In case if we do not have a silver lamp, a silver plate, can we do this still at home? Yes. Next option is um, copper. Or the third option is um, steel. Steel lamp or steel plate can be used instead of this. These are more available, easily available as well. So that can be used instead of a silver plate. Same procedure can be repeated with this also. That's always with a cow's ghee only. Cow's ghee is the best option and this. Yes, sir. But you cannot compromise this. Yes, sir. And how long this is going to take to collect the soup? Yeah, generally I think it takes five minutes. You can burn it for five minutes so that the entire ghee is burnt off and the soup is completely collected on the plate. Minimum five minutes you have to. So after the soot is collected, what happens? Once it is collected, you can take it in the, uh, another silver vessel and mix it carefully with the castor oil. Okay, that's how we have castor oil over there. Yeah. And how much of castor oil we will use to mix it? You can use castor oil in such a way that minimum required viscosity is maintained. Maybe half spoon to one spoon mm -hmm. for this much of uh, soot. See that it is very very smooth, no lumps or no powder is remaining in that. Mix it well with the castor oil and it is made in a very good paste. And after that, it's ready to use? Yeah, after? when it is ready to use. It so is kajal which can be used still readily. That means we can get rid of our lead eye pencils and all the other Yes, pencils. this is a very natural home remedy which can be used by anybody. It has to be applied from the medial side of the eye to the lateral side. That is a normal way you apply it. Medial mm -hmm. side means the inside the yeah, eye? Nasal, nasal side okay. to the lateral side. And we can use any finger for it or? Ring finger is ideal for using it. Okay. With the ring finger you apply it both on the lower eyelids and upper eyelids. It can be just left as such or if you want you can wash it after. Uh, 20 minutes time. Let me check whether this is ready. Yes, it is ready. Now you can mix it with a few drops of castor oil. When it's ready to use? Yes, it is ready to use. The kajal is ready with the mixing with castor oil. We are seeing how we will apply it. With the ring finger, pull the lower eyelid down 
from the medial aspect that is inside out, you apply it lightly. Same thing we repeat with the other eye. From the inside out, we apply it lightly. It can also be applied for the upper lid from inside out. The same method with the other eye. 